Jamie, a winning goal in the Edinburgh Derby. How did that feel? Hard to put into words. Um, I thought, you know, first half we were a bit patient in a way, and um, you know, second half came out like we did against Aberdeen and um, thought I was a bit unlucky, the keeper made a great save um, and then Scotty with his fantastic finish and then um, with my finish it was I knew where to put it and um, you know it was great to celebrate in front of the fans. And that's the kind of goal that we were told that you're, you're sort of noted for, you had three defenders round about you there, you'd done well to dig it out and find that gap in the corner. Yeah, look, I've got to stay patient and confident. You know, I mean, I've had chances against Aberdeen and, and Kilmarnock also, and you know, I know, I know I'll always score goals if I'm in the box. Um, I'll create chances, and you know, tonight showed that I'm a, I'm a sort of box player. But um, you know, I, I felt like we we worked hard as a team together, and um, and that's the thing at the moment. You get that rhythm of confidence, winning games, and um, you know, we're on a roll at the moment, and um, you know, we're just looking forward to the next game because it's it breathes confidence, and uh, that's what that's what happens in the team. And as a striker, I guess that's the key. You don't worry too much about the chances you miss. Yeah. You just wait for the next one to come along and try and bury it you can't afford to to sort of uh, put your head down I mean hit the crossbar and you know I knew I'm going to get another one and uh, you know thankfully I did and uh, you know it's, it's some feeling when it hits the back of the net honestly and you hear you know 20,000 fans uh, up in a roar and um, you know, have the boys jump on top of me and, and start screaming things it's just a great moment and uh, you know I'm sure the, the fans in green will go home happy and from your own point of view you've been named in the Australian <coughs> squad again this week Scoring goals in games like that, not really your chances any harm. Yeah, of course. I mean, uh, as a striker, you've got to be scoring goals. But um, you know, played 80, 85 minutes or so, and uh, that will put me in good stead. But uh, I don't expect too much. I mean, I've got to continue, uh, you know, with my own personal personal game. And if it happens, then uh, you know, um, you know, I can just focus on that. The key there, I think, was it was a tough battle in the first half, but we kept doing the right thing. We kept playing football, and ultimately, that won out in the end. Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's sort of a team, you know, we're patient and uh, we always create chances even when we are patient and um, it showed that when we, you know, stepped up a gear in the second half that uh, we were clinical and, uh, you know, it could have been a few more had my chance gone in, a few others, but, uh, you know, even the boys at the back were solid. Clean sheet at home, I mean, it, you couldn't ask for more. You mentioned there that we are on a good run. Point now behind Aberdeen. For a long time, Hibs have been in a position where we've always been worrying about teams behind us. Now we look at the teams above us and try and catch them. Yeah, I think it shows the mentality, you know, it stems down from the gaffer to the players and obviously we know what we want to do and we know, know what we have to do to, to stay in the, get to the top three and, uh, you know, we're close now, we can smell it. So, um, you know, we got to focus on the guys above us and, and not worry about what's behind us and uh, since since I've come to the club, that's all that's all been the mentality and, uh, you know, it breathes through the squad and, and uh, you know, through the staff as well and um, it holds us in good stead. And that's your first experience of an Edinburgh derby here at Easter Road. Sunshine on Leith at the end, how did that feel? Amazing. Uh, it's, it's always nicer when you win and obviously score a goal at, at that little bit of a spice. But uh, it is nice to send some fans home happy because I know I was actually watching the, the last derby and obviously fans weren't too happy. But, you know, when you send them home happy, it's it's extra sweet and, um, you know, they deserve it because they get behind us. And, um, you know, equally, it's a, it's a brilliant night in Leith. From your own point of view, that first goal from open play, fancy yourself going to score in spree now? Yeah, absolutely. I mean, it's it's one of those ones I know no matter what, if I'm playing from the start, I'll always create chances. And um, sometimes as a striker, it only takes one, you know, in play to, to get that confidence. You know, you get that monkey off your back and, um, you know, the Rangers was a penalty, but a goal's a goal for me in my mind. And, um, you know, I'll just kick on from now.